On Tuesday, Executive Mosaic showcased the accomplishments of two exceptional technology innovators, Oracle's Pat Mungavin and Intel's Cameron Chera, in honor of their 2023 WASH 100 award wins. Major General Jan Norris, Chief Information Security Officer and Deputy Chief Information Officer of the U.S. Army, said the service branch is working on a strategy to complete zero trust adoption by 2027. Robin Milton has been elevated to Vice President of Strategic Communications and Marketing at LMI. The Department of Commerce has partnered with NASA and the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration to assess the competitiveness of the domestic civil space industrial base. Senator Ron Wyden has called on the office of the Senate Sergeant at Arms to initiate additional steps to advance the adoption of phishing-resistant multi-factor authentication in the upper chamber. Representatives Kathy Rogers and Frank Poloni have reintroduced a pair of bills that would advance innovation, security and competition in the commercial satellite communications industry. Representative Mike Gallagher has reintroduced a measure that would direct the current administration to declassify all information related to the potential association of the COVID-19 pandemic with China's Wuhan Institute of Virology. The National Institute of Standards and Technology has launched a community of interest for companies and trade associations to share their insights and expertise to help NIST meet SB cybersecurity needs. Join GovConWire's event's third annual IC Acquisition and Technology Innovation Forum on March 9, 2023. Visit govconwire.com events. A group of Senate lawmakers is urging the Department of the Treasury to expand opportunities for underserved and underrepresented small businesses and entrepreneurs nationwide by diverting funding to the Minority Business Development Agency. The Federal Aviation Administration is seeking public comment on its proposal to require the disclosure of planned aircraft design modifications in certification applications.